I guess they can't hear me over this music. You actually made it. Come in. Hey, okay. Honestly, I was studying, so I didn't think I was gonna make it. Oh, these must be your friends. Yeah, so this is Isaiah and this is Roman. Hi. Hey, so this guy right here knows how to have a good time. Let's get drinks. All right, all right, I'll meet y'all over there. All right, Slowpoke, hurry up. Go, it's okay, I don't mind. I'll be back. Hey, finally. Fast lane when I pass in the street, bag of money in the passenger seat. Simple's been asking for me on the road from the west to the east. Way up, I might never come down, cause the coast wrecking up the flame mouth. So high, I might never come down, so what? This is my lifestyle. Wait a minute. Sam, over here! Oh, hey, girl. Hey, I didn't expect to see you here. Yeah, well, you know, I just had to pop in and see how you were doing. Um, yeah, we just got here not too long ago. August is, uh, over there. I told him to go have fun with the boys. I was just about to get something to drink. Oh, um, dang, can I have a drink too? Um, yeah, they're right over here. Girl, you ain't gonna drink nothing? I've never drank before. Just take it slow. Okay. Don't overdo it now. Dang, girl, you're done already? I said don't overdo it. No, whatever was in that drink, I might just need another one. I've just been so nervous about coming to this party. And August is over there getting turned up. I need yeah, to I, I need see. to loosen up. Like, I need to match his energy, right? Um, well, this is your first time drinking, so like I said, you don't want to do too much. Okay. Just be okay. yourself. You don't have to drink. All right, I'll, I'll put it down. I don't think I need it. Wait, I just remembered you didn't fill me in on your little date. Oh my gosh, you're right, I didn't. My bad. Yeah. Okay, well, it started off cute. Like, he met me at his car, and he had a present for me and a balloon, and we drove out to this diner. Ooh. And yeah, it was cute or whatever, but then, girl, you'll never believe what happened. What? Spill. Girl, we got there. It was so cute. We had ordered our food, and then my ex, my crazy ex-boyfriend, Anthony, ended up being the chef at the diner, and he saw us, and he confronted me, and him and August were getting into it. It was crazy. Oh, my God. Wait, 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 and then get this. On the way out, he said, bye, Rosa Parks. Bye, Rosa Parks. No, he didn't. And did. Girl. And he's white? Oh, nah. No, I don't, I don't know. This is exactly why I couldn't be with him, but I didn't know, I didn't know he worked there, so. Yeah, that's a crazy coincidence. Yeah. Then what happened when y'all did? Oh, okay. So after he was like, I'll take you home. And I was like, no, I don't, I don't want to go back to the dorms yet. So I told him that I heard about this place. Yeah. Make out point like you said. So mm -hmm. um, we went there and, you know, things were getting a little heated in the car or whatever. And oh. then guess what? What now, girl? <sighs> Just as things were starting to get a little crazy, there was a knock out the window. And no, it wasn't Anthony. It was the park police and we were trespassing. No, not the popo. Yeah, so I don't know. Maybe after the party, you know, if August doesn't get too crazy or whatever, we can maybe finish what we started. Oh, okay. <laughs> yes, yes, girl. Um, oh, uh, that's him calling me right now. Um, I'm gonna go see what he wants, okay? All right, all right. All right, I'll see you around, girl. Okay. Oh, let me get me a slice of this pizza before I leave. Uh, never mind. I don't want none of this cold ass pizza. Forget it. She like me. She might be what I need. Take it spicy. Want to taste this? Come by me. Yeah. I'm icy. Way too icy. Hey, Roman. Sorry to interrupt. Oh, well, you did. Can I take my girl upstairs? Dude, you're wasted. Just don't break anything. No promises. Hey, uh, follow me. Where are we going? 
Just come on. Move. Excuse us, sorry about him. What exactly did you think we were gonna be doing in this nasty room? There's literally a pizza box on the floor. Well, uh... Well, uh, what? August, you are a mess right now. We can just chill here for a little. I just want to spend some time with you. August, this is not attractive at all and your breath stinks. What are you doing? You're getting your drink all over his bed. No, you can stay up here. I'm leaving. We could talk tomorrow or something. The police? Oh no, not again. Party's over, guys. Get out. These stupid kids again, always throwing these parties. The police are here? You've got to be kidding me. August, did you hear me? I said the police are here, and everyone else at this party booked it. We're the only ones left. We're going to get arrested. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. I shouldn't have came to this party in the first place. Huh? Oh, my gosh. Nothing I'm saying is registering in your brain right now. You just had to get wasted. Oh, no. Um... I'm so lost. What's going on? You had too much to drink. A police officer is here. We are in college. We're not supposed to be drinking on campus. You can't even stand up straight. Oh, sh And what exactly do you think closing the blinds is gonna do? Are you dumb? He's already inside already. Shh. I hear you two in there. Open up. Well, what now, genius? We can't stay here forever. Hello, are you dumb? Get up. We can't have him see you like this. I can't do this right now. You're absolutely useless. <sighs> Just open the door. Uh, hi, sir. Hey, officer. Uh, we were just leaving. Neither of you are going anywhere, except with me, down to the station. Down to the station? Why? We're, we're completely fine. Yeah, yeah, we'll see about that. Move it, downstairs, now. Uh, dude, my mom's gonna kill me. You, young man, walk this straight line for me, right here, mm-hmm. Great, and you better not mess up. Yeah, yeah, I, I got this, I got this. I didn't even have anything to drink. Easy. Oh, no. <laughs> Just nasty. Ew. That's all I needed to see. Y'all are coming with me. Do you really have to do this, officer? I'm guessing you guys aren't 21 yet? No. Mm-hmm. Well, let's see what your parents think about that. Sorry, I mean it. Good, you should be. I'm bringing two party animals down to the station. Have a cell ready. August, I cannot believe you have us in jail. What if we get kicked out of school or something? I never should have went to the party. I honestly never expected something like this to happen. It was just supposed to be a fun little party, but I guess I overdid it. You guess? I can't wait to get out of here. Yes, I'm here to pick up my son, Augie. Oh my goodness, I can't believe this. So you must be the Hoochie Mama's mama. She got my poor Augie bear in trouble. Hoochie Mama? My daughter is not a Hoochie Mama. I don't know who you think you're talking to. Clearly, I'm talking to you. Clearly, your daughter is a bad influence on my son. Well, you see, that's not the case at all. From what I heard... 
Your son is the one that invited her to this party in the first place. So it seems like your son is the one that influenced her. And after all, he is older than her too. Don't you dare talk about my son, don't you dare. Oh, you people are trifling. I think you're the one that needs to lose the attitude. I'll pray for you next time I go to church. Oh, the nerve of some people. Your parents are here, follow me. And don't let this happen again. Oh, my poor Augie Bear. Mama's here, don't worry. Did that little girl hurt you? Let Mama get a good look at you. Oh, no, you can't even stand up straight. We gonna get you together, son. No more going to parties with hoochie mamas. Mom, don't worry. I'm fine, and Akila's not a hoochie mama. Oh, you don't know what you're saying. All right, here. Come on. Mama's here, Mama's here. Just what has gotten into you, young lady? Do you think I spent all this money for you to go to college to be some party girl? No. Finally, it seems like you have some common sense tonight. I am very disappointed in you. And your father would be too. I know, and I'm sorry. No, you don't know. This has been the dumbest thing you have ever done in your entire life. Go get in the car. Yes, ma'am. And I don't want you talking to that little boy anymore. Okay, everyone, well, this episode got a little crazy, but thankfully we're out of jail and we're not kicked out of school. But I hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. And with that being said, I'll see you guys next time. Bye!